This is a demonstration of a Image Trends scanner mouse, and we have the application launched. Uh, when we first move the mouse around, you can see that it just functions as a video camera, and it just shows whatever is underneath. It's really just used to position the mouse. And as soon as we position it, and I'll, in this case I'll position it on the corner of the picture, I press down on the top uh, of the scroll wheel, uh, that's what we've set to start it. We can use any button, frankly, to program to uh, start it. Uh, I then go back and forward. It's, it's capturing these images at 15 frames per second, uh, and it's displaying them on the screen. The final stitching will take place after we've stopped, but this at least shows the user where they've been and uh, what they need to scan. The red portion shows what has not yet been scanned and also shows if there's a spot that's been missed. Um, and the, um, uh, as long as there's no red, you're okay. You can also go back over an image and capture it if you've missed a spot. If you press the uh, uh, scroll wheel again, it then reprocesses it. Now it's, it's properly stitched together. We can uh, rotate this uh, in large increments uh, with the scroll wheel or pressing down on the shift key, we can use small increments. Um, and then we can position it to, to crop it if we want, uh, like this, and just use a normal, it's, it's very, very simple uh, editing tools uh, that you would normally find uh, to crop. Uh, uh, we can also uh, zoom in and out here or, and move around, uh, but in our case we're just going to save it um, as a standard compression JPEG and now it's in the file and if we use the Windows uh, viewer you can see there it is, we can zoom in and you can see that's the uh, the picture that was captured.